I like to paint outside because I like to paint how it feels. I'm not really just painting an image of a place. I'm not like a big eye that just gets out of the car and says, oh, that's pretty. I have to take it in. I have to hike it and walk it and know it and breathe it and dance it, and then I can paint. And so this painting is about that kind of experience, about having been around there for a while, knowing the Sonoma Coast. And then I realized that I really show maybe more than one point of view, and the time goes on. It's not like just one moment in a day, and it's not at all like painting from a photograph. It has a liveliness that moves with the water and the waves and the fog coming in and out. And my technique is kind of influenced by the fact that I've worked in more than one medium. So for a long time, I did wet and wet watercolor painting, which is soaking a piece of paper till it's really saturated and then painting with wet paint on it so that everything gets soft edges. And I also um, have done a lot of pastels with layering colors, which all, uh, not rubbing it together, but letting the layers show. And so all of that has become part of my oil paintings. And so you can see I'm really interested in what you would call scumbling color over color, which is that you let one layer show through the next one. And I believe that because I made all those watercolor paintings with soft edges, it's made me feel like a painting looks like my painting when it has some soft edges and not just sharp edges. And the soft edges allow things to go back in space. And then when I want it to become more forward, I make a sharper edge.